is Ariana Grande's REM beauty a flop? Ariana Grande, the pop sensation known for her powerful vocals and signature ponytail, ventured into the beauty industry with her brand REM Beauty. With a massive following and a strong presence in the music industry, many expected Grande's foray into beauty to be a resounding success. However, despite the initial hype and anticipation, REM Beauty has failed to make a significant impact in the market. In this video, we'll take a look at why Ariana Grande's REM Beauty might be a flop. One of the primary reasons behind REM Beauty's failure is its lack of authenticity and a strong brand identity. In a market where consumers seek products that align with their values and beliefs, REM Beauty failed to establish a clear brand identity. The brand's messaging and product offerings seem disconnected from Ariana Grande's personal style and image, leaving consumers unsure about what REM's beauty truly represented. Successful beauty brands often succeeded by creating a unique and cohesive brand story that resonates with their target audience. However, REM Beauty lacked a compelling narrative and failed to communicate a distinct brand personality. This lack of authenticity made it difficult for consumers to form an emotional connection with the brand, resulting in a lack of brand loyalty and limited consumer interest. Another significant factor contributing to REM Beauty's flop is its ineffective marketing and promotion strategies. While Ariana Grande boasts a massive following on social media, REM Beauty failed to leverage this advantage to create a buzz around the brand. The promotional campaigns lack innovation and failed to generate excitement among consumers. Furthermore, the brand's marketing efforts were relatively limited and failed to reach a wider audience. REM Beauty did not invest in strategic partnerships or collaborations with influential beauty influencers or establish a strong online presence. Without a well-executed marketing strategy, the brands struggled to gain visibility and capture the attention of potential customers, leading to underwhelming sales. REM Beauty's limited product range and lack of innovation also played a significant role in its failure. The brand initially launched with a relatively small selection of products, offering limited choices to consumers. In a market driven by constant product innovation and a demand for newness, REM Beauty failed to keep up with evolving beauty trends. Additionally, the brand did not introduce any groundbreaking or innovative products that set it apart from competitors. REM Beauty's offerings were seen as conventional and unremarkable, failing to excite beauty enthusiasts. In a saturated market where consumers are constantly seeking unique and innovative formulations, REM Beauty's lack of standout products further contributed to its inability to gain traction. One of the recurring criticisms faced by REM Beauty was its lack of inclusivity and diversity. The brand faced backlash for its limited shade ranges, particularly in foundation and concealer products, which did not cater to a wide range of skin tones. In an industry that emphasizes the importance of inclusivity and celebrates diversity, REM Beauty's failure to address this crucial aspect resulted in alienating a significant portion of potential customers. Moreover, REM Beauty's marketing and promotional materials lack representation and fail to feature individuals from diverse backgrounds. The lack of inclusivity not only highlighted a missed opportunity to connect with a broader consumer base, but also showcased a disconnect between the brand and the prevailing industry standards. REM Beauty's lack of customer engagement and feedback was another contributing factor to its flop. The brand failed to create a platform for open communication with its customers, hindering its ability to understand their preferences, concerns, and feedback. This lack of interaction prevented REM Beauty from making necessary improvements and adjustments based on customer needs and desires. Successful beauty brands often prioritize customer engagement through various channels such as social media platforms, customer surveys, and interactive campaigns. By actively listening to their customers, brand can build a loyal following and adapt their products and strategies accordingly. Unfortunately, REM Beauty missed this opportunity which ultimately resulted in a diminished connection with consumers and a lack of brand loyalty. Timing is crucial in the beauty industry and unfortunately, REM Beauty entered a market that was already saturated with numerous established and emerging beauty brands. The market was inundated with celebrity-owned beauty lines, making it challenging for REM Beauty to carve out a distinct space and differentiate itself from the competitors. Moreover, the timing of REM Beauty's launch coincided with a period of shifting consumer preferences and emerging beauty trends. The brand failed to capitalize on these trends and cater to the evolving needs of beauty consumers. 
By not staying ahead of the curve and offering innovative and relevant products, REM Beauty lost the opportunity to capture the attention of trend-conscious consumers. To thrive in the highly competitive beauty industry, brands must establish a strong brand identity, engage with their customers, offer innovative products, and stay attuned to evolving customer preferences. Unfortunately, REM Beauty fell short on these crucial fronts, resulting in its inability to make a significant impact in the market. And with that being said, it's time to end our video. Subscribe to the channel for more amazing videos like this. We'll see you with another interesting video.